Thank you. My name is Nina Horwitz, and this is my NHS committee project. I'm doing the invention of cars and the history of automobiles. The very first self-powered road vehicle was were powered by steam engines. And by that definition, Nicholas Joseph Cugnot of France built the first automobile in 1769. This person right here in 16, he is a Dutch physicist, Christian Hugh Jens, and this is in 1680, and he designed but never built an internal combustion engine that was to be fueled with gunpowder, which was one of the first engines that was made. This person, this is in 1807, Francis Isaac de Rivas of Switzerland invented an internal combustion engine that used a mixture of hydrogen and oxygen for fuel. Rivas designed a car for his engine. And this was the first engine that powered an automobile, but it was unsuccessful in a car. This is the engine. And then in 1824, an English engineer, Samuel Brown, adapted an old new common steam engine to burn gas and he used it to briefly power a vehicle in London. And this is his engine. In 1858, Belgian-born engineer Jean Joseph Etienne Lenoir invented a double-acting electric spark ignition internal combustion engine fueled by coal gas. In 1863, he attached an, his improved engine to a three-wheeled wagon that managed to complete a 50-mile road trip. This is his engine. In 1864, Austrian engineer Siegfried Marcus built a one-cylinder engine with a crude carburetor and attached his engine to a cart for a 50-foot drive. Several years later, he designed a vehicle that briefly ran at 10 miles per hour, which a few historians have considered as the forerunner of the modern automobile by being the fir world's first gasoline-powered vehicle. This was his vehicle. In 1873, George Brayton... An American engineer developed an unsuccessful two-stroke kerosene engine, but it was considered to be the first safe and practical oil engine. And that's it right there. In 1876, Nicholas August Otto invented a later patent this successful four-stroke engine known as the Otto Cycle, which is this. And then in 1885, Gottlieb Damler invented was often recognized as a prototype of the modern gas engine with a vertical cylinder and with a gasoline injected through a carburetor. And this was his engine. And then, as we know, Henry Ford, he is the amazing American car manufacturer and he invented an improved assembly line and installed the first conveyor belt assembly line in his car factory in Ford Highland Park, Michigan plant. The assembly line reduced production costs for cars by reducing assembly time, and his famous Model T was assembled in 92 minutes using that. Ford made his first car called the Quadricycle in June 1896. However, success came after he formed the Ford Motor, Co Motor Company in 1903. The Model T was the third car manufacturing company formed to produce the cars he designed. He introduced Model T in 1908, and it was a success. And then, Carl Benz is in a German mechanical engineer, and he designed the world's first practical automobile to be powered by an engine. And he received, in 1886, the first gas-fueled car. And that is all.